your brother gave his life, and this is a vet, gave his life for the city of Fargo and for the citizens of Fargo, what can you do for him? Fargo Mayor Tim Mahoney is encouraging continued support for the family of a fallen Fargo officer. Good evening and thank you for joining us. The official Moser Family Benefit Fund is at Bell State Bank and you must donate in person. Well, today the City Fargo Police Department and the Impact Foundation announced a way that people can safely donate online. With so many fundraising sites available, it's important to know your money will actually get to a family or a cause you want to support. Officials say to be cautious. You may recall a northern Minnesota woman was recently charged for stealing money from a GoFundMe account. Valley News Team's Ashley Bishop investigates two crowdfunding accounts created for Officer Mosier to find out if they're legit and how police are making sure people are taking advantage of this tragedy. To me, it didn't seem right that those closest should set it up. So it's like, what can I do? So I tried. Aaron Jonason says he met Jason Mosier a few times. Their daughters do gymnastics together. He says he created the fundraising page Thursday morning because he hadn't seen any others created yet. His goal was five grand. It, it's obviously not what I thought would ever happen. Uh, people's generosity far, far exceeded what I thought I could do. Aaron's site has raised more than $30,000 so far. Fargo police contacted him verifying that all money will go to the Mosier family. I've been working with uh, one of the sergeants and then uh, on Tuesday I'll be meeting with the ones that are running the committee for the fundraisers. Creator Pam Wanner Majonis says she is a former dispatcher and knows Fargo officers. She told us over the phone that she's working to get the money to Mosier's wife through Fargo officers. How did you know the family? You know, why are you doing this? How do I know you're not going to do what they did up north? Aaron and Pam say they both received plenty of emails from people asking if the sites were legit. It's not for me. I don't take any offense. So anybody has questions, I'm, I'm trying to answer them. Aaron says people have been donating across the country, and he is amazed by the support yes. that the community is giving to oh the Mosier gosh. family. And I can't iterate this enough. It's not a competition. I honestly... You know, I'm not trying to steer people one way or the other. I don't care. It's all going to the family. Ashley Bishop, Valley News Live. GoFundMe and CrowdRise do take a percentage of the funds donated to pay for their operating expenses. Fargo Police and the city urge people to donate to the official Moser Family Benefit Fund. There's a link to that on our website. Click on this story on valleynewslive.com. Also, because of North Dakota state law, the Moser family, children, will be able to go to any North Dakota public university for free. Law enforcement in Fargo 